Hello everybody, my name is Karen Fire and welcome back to Ken and Excels. Today, a lot of things have been going on. Last episode, I said I was going to do some building and I definitely have. I had no idea how this was going to look, but I decided to build an extension onto the house with some kind of really weird wizard tower thing. I, I don't know, you're going to see it anyway, it's very strange. So down the stairs we go and you're going to notice, oh, it looks, it looks the same, you know, there's, oh, oh, there's a hole. <laughs> I don't know whether to move this or not, but for some really weird reason, I quite like there being like a secret hole entrance. Anyway, I haven't moved many things in here yet, but we have a fireplace. This thing. Conan, if you're listening, please make this better to place down because you can't place it. It seems like it doesn't want to ever place straight. It always has to be slightly wonky. Maybe they did this on purpose, but it's very annoying. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, sorting Sarah's down here doing this very weird bug thing that they seem to do quite a lot of lately. They do the whole <laughs> Anyway, we're going to go upstairs and we have a little, you know, Brutus tribute. So that was for both of the dogs in the start of the season. We lost two dogs called Bojangles and Toby. And then we have this weird bookcase thing from the uh, battle pass, I believe. I didn't realize it opens and then stays weirdly open. Oh, well. And then there's the secret hole. What is in that hole? Who? Guess in the comments down below. <laughs> You'll, you'll find out. <laughs> anyway, I took some inspiration from like bottom builds with the pathway. I don't know if I did it as good as he would have done, but you know, I think I did pretty good for someone that hasn't done that before, I, I guess. Either way, uh, I took some inspiration. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you guys didn't know, I recently did a building competition on my channel. Please go and watch it if you haven't watched it already. It is a draw my thing thing. And it was really fun to make and it was just big 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 thing to do uh so yeah anyway we still have the uh graves right here so we have well have been decorating it even more i have so many incense things around it and a candlestick um and then yeah this is the extension and uh oh yeah the weird wizard tower thing i really don't know what i was doing with this but it it, it just is a thing <laughs> <laughs> kind of looks like a really big nipple i don't know but that's kind of what it is like i guess from a distance it looks kind of cool as long as you're not too close to it <laughs> but anyway that's kind of what we've done and then i have a podium now for well just you know daniel the club doctor <laughs> so he can check it up there and i don't have to hear him because i started hearing him again when he was over here so anyway Things have moved around and things look a little better now. More room! Anyway, we're going to be taking the frogs out today because I have a mission which includes our fragments of power. I'm going to spend them all, hopefully, uh, which I might regret because it might use up all of my stuff, but hey. <laughs> and then I need to do a vault because I've run out of Eldarium. So, I'm going to bring... Ooh, who do I want to bring today? Rosie, maybe? Oh! yeah we have a new frog uh his name was last threat but now he's shrek <laughs> thank you for to the same person who suggested the fiona name and they picked shrek um but i gotta color the armor i feel before i start using him because he has to be green um he, he just has to be green okay speaking of sets so i do think i've picked up spares i think i might have a set for him you know that's funny i'm gonna put one of those on a damage kit grab some steak because he's gonna need it isn't it so pretty when you just make everything snot green oh yeah <laughs> do you know what this reminds me of the time i had fruit ninja people i can already see this is absolutely garish oh my goodness gracious me what have i done <laughs> <laughs> um yeah he don't stick out like a sore thumb at all <laughs> uh, i might take him out you know yeah let's take him out today actually you know why not he could do a vault with us and he can like power level there you go if only i could paint your mace as well 
you might have noticed as well i switched my shield skin it basically is the blood letter shield um from the arena pack i believe it is yeah blood letter shield and it just to me looks like i have a huge like fancy sombrero on my back that's like hanging off my neck or something so i thought that looked way cooler than what i had before anyway let's go out we're gonna go out together and we're gonna go and spend all of my shards first task is to go into the tower well we defeated all the guards so that was the first one really um but we're gonna go inside and we go danger looks across the isle of sifter no no ooh. they're flying <laughs> hacking <laughs> so this is my first time inside of this building this uh this playthrough so i can click on any of the altars like right here it doesn't matter which one i pick i might get a uh, random blueprint so hopefully i will by spending my fragments of power which thankfully are in there anyway we got a scroll oh wait we didn't use one yet <laughs> void forge bow i got two of those god damn it fast elevators we like that heavyweight trungeon is really good void forge shield oh uh, yeah yeah i like it fast elevators again oh no Silent Legion Light Armor, that's really good to unlock that. The Gladius, the Dragon Hide Armor, love that. What have we got over here? The Great Axe, ooh, very nice. What else are we going to get? The Gladius again. The Great Axe again. <laughs> the Great Axe again. <laughs> oh, God. Fast Elevators again. Silent Legion Light again. Oh, God. Katana, that's a new one. Uh, medium Armor, that's good. Uh, the... For, uh, the Chris was that I don't know Gladius I don't know why I'm moving between them I really don't need to uh, Katana do we get anything else Vagabond armor and the war axe thank you hardened steel cages great sword woodforge bow pike sword <laughs> oh god <laughs> parchments <laughs> more parchments a katana and the light armor are we are we done yet i feel like i've spent more than i have <laughs> dragon bone armor that's good that's something i wanted void forge arrows more parchments a void forge i didn't even get to read that the chris again and amount of fragments of power so there we go we got all of our goodies so look at here this should tell me what i got i got the dragon uh the void forge dragon armor the ferroxic oh no that's not that <laughs> medium silent legion light silent legion we also got there we go great axe great sword katana oh the crystal daggers okay and the shield the shield might actually be pretty good for me as well and the war axe and then we have the other two dragon bone um, armors so it's actually kind of ideal uh what we got so we did get some nice things through that um i was happy spending them a bit sad i didn't see uh anything else really pop up but apart from that it's pretty good going and this is all spares so i don't know where i'm gonna shove this i'm gonna have to find somewhere i can't really put them in a container or anything so uh maybe i'll just have to see who wants them one day or something <laughs> uh, all right i don't like those rumbly noises you're making no 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 all right everybody's coming along anyway i'm gonna pick a forge to go to not forge pick a thing to go to i think one i really want to do is actually on the other side and it's one of my favorite ones just because it feels uniquer than the rest i think i'm going to go to the bat vault which is all the way over here so we got quite the gallop to go all right here we go we're at the batty retreat <laughs> oh, hello so over here is uh, lots of bats, uh, big, small, evil, uh, dive bomby. I like this vault because it has like the most unique feel to itself. Like you have duplicates of vaults, um, but this one feels like it has like the most thought out kind of color design and whatever else you want to call it. Oh no, maybe it's just because it's like this really atmospheric purple um but either way it's it's really nice of a vault and it just feels like a lot of uh, love went into it in comparison to some other ones that are maybe a little uh less special looking anyway i'm looking for a particular thing and i can't find it 
or too busy blabbing. All right, so it's either in the front or it's in the water or it's leaning up against something or I'm looking in the wrong places. I never remember where these things are. Where are you? <laughs> there it is. Oh, it's going blind. There we go. Anyway, this one's really cool though if you've never seen it before. What's that? That looked like a switch for a minute there. <laughs> I was like, I've never seen this before, oh my god. Anyway, very purple themed, very cool. I wish some other ones were done a bit like this or something. But uh, yeah, we go into the bat people. Oh my goodness, you just like tossed him big time. <laughs> tossed him like a salad, like. <laughs> All right, you guys. Um, so I do have my horse in here with me. Um, I, again, I don't usually like taking them, but... Um, leaving him outside, it's pretty dicey as well. So, we bring him in there for the extra storage, um, and then hope he doesn't run off into any other, like, bats or stuff. Because that's what happens with them, that's the main annoying part, is when they run into other things. Um, because they get hit, or they, um, pretty much just target lock them from the get-go. Um, so that could be super annoying either way. Hello! Right, you guys, you want to go for... Oh, not that one. Well, that's not what I had in mind, but there you go. Attack that. <laughs> Whoopsie daisy. i remember my key bindings again. There we go. Kill the bat demons. Yeah. We did get quite a lot of uh, hide the other day, so I'm not going to bother to harvest them. However, if you do go up here, there is occasionally some loot chests i don't mean occasionally i mean there is loot chests <laughs> i don't know why i said occasionally or oh like mm, there should be loot mm. i'm losing marbles <laughs> maybe it's this one or maybe i was right when saying occasionally i don't know either way sometimes <laughs> there's loot chests up here that you can grab i swear there is yeah there it is i was I was losing my mind. <laughs> I swear there used to be one up on the other side. I, 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 whatever. Um, anyway. <laughs> down we go. Let's just forget about it. Does, it doesn't matter. <laughs> There's a hand on the floor. Hard to see. Well, a claw, according to the game. And then we're about to get bombarded in bats because for some reason they stuck them too close together. Although you can always dive off the side and totally avoid a lot of things here. Oh, God. Get out of here! Oh my goodness, <laughs> they're going ping ponged everywhere. Poor guys. Ow! Looks like I ended up on the floor this time. Get out of here, you! Yeah, you tell him, Fiona. I haven't heard uh, Shrek yet tell us some of his uh, legendary lines. I was really hoping, like, uh, let's get out of my swamp or get out of my swamp would slip out there. Um, but it, it doesn't seem to have come out yet. <laughs> oh, he has the polite accent. He's like, oh, your death will be as meaningless as your life. But it actually sounds like I'm complimenting you, voice. <laughs> he has that calm, calm voice. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's going to be funny. He's different from um, <laughs> Derek, who's just like, die. He like, gives them a mean ass insults big time. <laughs> well, it looks like these guys have not much of interest on them either way. This dude's stuck in the uh, blood bowl. Too much blood for you, sir. Go yeah, he has that. <laughs> it's like such a low tone, calm voice. He's just like, yeah, slaying. Yay. <laughs> He's like. Oh, whatever. We'll get the bat trophy. We need a lot of Alderian, by the way, to even be able to um, make a lot of the trophies and stands, which is bum. Ah! You're like whispering insults. What is this, my dude? <laughs> He's literally whispering insults. That's amazing. <laughs> He's got the same lines as the other guy, though, so... That's all right. Anyway, we're going downtown into the sewers because there is some uh, friends in here. All right, hello. Hello, my favorite. 
There's also baby bats in here, isn't there? All over the floor. Alright, you get out of the way. He's doing good damage though. He's level 6 already, another 4 levels, and we get to see what he is capable of. Anyways, there's any chests, any goodies. Oh, I see a chest. Yeah, more Elderium. That's exactly what we want. That's what I was hoping for. And more Batman. I wasn't hoping for more Batman, but you know. Hey, I stopped your animation. You get sucked on. Oh, hello. <laughs> what are you doing in the centrist way? You're like, I didn't like the other one, but we'll do this one with the scary bats in it. Do you guys want to actually attack them today, or are you just going to play uh, floor charades? He <laughs> got flung away so far. It's like, your death is meaningless as your life. Like. <laughs> anyway, through here we go into the next door. Is there any treasure chests? They might be around uh, one of the sides. There's a lot of Batman, though. A lot of Batman. Do you guys want to get that one? Off he goes! They're so slow. <laughs> They're just gingerly taking their time. Like, yeah, we go around here. We get the big baddie. And it's like... You might as well be saying thank you! With the... <laughs> guy outside of... He might... He just might as well be saying thank you, dudes. I swear. <laughs> I think Fiona's gonna have to do all the insults for you at this rate. Oh, jeez. We gotta work on that, my friend. Any chests over here? I swear there's chesty somewhere. Oh, gosh. I'm gonna piss off all the bats. When I don't want to, because there ain't no loot. And there ain't nothing in it for me. Alright, get stuck in there. I'm going around the corner to uh, lose health again. <laughs> Where do all these guys come from? I swear we dealt with, like several of you already. Ow! I need my shield, really. I'm getting minced otherwise. I'm gonna suck up some of those lovely potions. That should help life. And then we we'll get rid of that for you. There you go! Well, at least there was a little elder in minute for me. What are you doing? <gasps> you Alchemical base. Did I pick that up? I didn't. What the hell? <laughs> Uh, anyway, boss room. Let's get this guy to come over. I might see if I can get them guys to go after the boss. I don't think. I think I've got to get closer first. And this is one I might actually want my shield for because he does uh, dive bombs and stuff. From, from what I remember, he's not awful uh, to do either way. Right, you want to get him? Off we go. I'm gonna turn out the light. So you get purple uh, mood mist. <laughs> purple mood mist time! Yeah! Doing pretty decent, you know. This dude isn't even attacking. Do your little flappy wappy time. Well, I mean, at least got a shot in, you know. Come on, do your fly thing. It's so cool. He does this thing where he teleports in the air if he wants to, but um, I guess today is not the day we get to see that. Which is unfortunate, because that's one of my favourite attacks from him, but hey. We killed the champion bat. Oh, he dropped his weapon! Silent Slash. Yummy! I'll have all of that. You know, it's not often I collect all the boss loot. And then we we'll take his, uh, you know, flesh, blood, leather, all of his bits and bobs. Um, and yeah, lovely, lovely, lovely. Feel like we got some, uh, decent- oh. You're full of stuff. <laughs> what is this? I guess I didn't empty you. Oh. I always try and... Oh, that's his wardrobe. That's um, from the fashionist. Mm, is it fashionist? Or it's a mess of armor. I can't remember. Um, either way, you could put accessories on them so I could give them butt lanterns if that's what you're wondering what that is. Um, but anyway, that is this vault. We are done here. That's all we needed. Oh, my hair's getting in my eyes. I gotta trim my hair soon or something. <laughs> it's uh, becoming death. Anyway, we gotta see what the sigil of the bat does. It's been a hot minute. Mm, and there we go. That's probably what I want out of that. And then, what does the sigil do? 
Boosting their ability to jump when sprinting. I like that. Let's eat that. I think so far I'm doing well on my sigils. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Are we halfway now? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're over halfway on sigils, so we're doing really well on sigils, actually. So if we keep on collecting, we will become like the absolute unit. <laughs> I wish they did some more stuff like this on Exiles, you know, because it's kind of awesome that you can just boost yourself by um, going around these places. Anyway, we have the Bolt Armory. Bolt Armory? Bolt Armory? Bat Armory? Batty. <laughs> We're going Batty, apparently. <laughs> we got the Nurgle stuff either way. Um, I have been recommended to try this, I think it is, the Throwing X of the Nurgle. I'll double check the comments, but I'm pretty sure it was that. And um, yeah, uh, they want to see me do spin to win. <laughs> Which I agree, spin to win is very fun. So I'll probably be looking into trying that. I do like having a shield though often on my builds because it just creates that bit of, uh, oh, if you're having trouble, you get to whip that out and uh, hopefully not die, TM. <laughs> Um, but that's pretty much what that is. Anyway, that vault is complete, which I believe... I have done this vault. I have done this vault. I think that's all the vaults on the right-hand side of the map done. We just need to do the bat one. Not the bat one. A spider one up there. The other drowned one. Uh, we need to do the Valeria, the harpy, and both. Oh, we didn't do the snake one. You know, we are pretty close to the snake one, but I don't know if you guys would want to watch two vaults in one video. It is kind of um, bum bum. I, I try to keep them separate because, uh, you know, uh, you, I don't know. <laughs> I just do because it's like a bit too much vault for one video. Either way. Ooh, look at that in the night. I bet there's a few people around here, honestly, because back here is usually kind of a popular place to build. I've seen so many new builds uh, this time come in here as well. The Lonely Grave! I thought since we're going on our way, we might as well visit this as well. Um, because I haven't been here yet. I don't know how the hell you missed me. Because on my screen, you clearly hit me. <laughs> oh, dearie me. You got some dodgy aiming, sir. <laughs> this is some nice staggering. I wonder if he's going to give us anything good, you know. Are you fully dead? In the brain? Oh my goodness, I think he is. <laughs> I've never seen a boss look so sad in his life. Ooh, he did peck a bit of health off of me then, that actually hurt. Alright, dude. Down you go. Downtown. Bone Guardian. Ah, oh, lag. There we go, that's what we wanted. Very nice stuff. You give putrid meat. Yummy. <laughs> Yeah, you could make all the ichor with that, couldn't you? Yeah, there we go. And we'll take his money. We'll take his spending money. Well, that kind of looks like it's coming out of the rock when you do that. I was wondering if I'd find any of those diggables up here. Uh, considering he's guarding his grave, though, and he's still alive. I guess that answers my question for me pretty well. In this forest as well, there is a place that you can learn um, animal cages. Um, but it is quite hidden from what I remember. Is this part or the next part on? Either way, I think what I'm going to do is tie up this episode here, and then I'm going to do a whole episode looking at the Serpent Vault and New Luxor. I think that way you don't have a, a very ridiculously long video, which I'm sure for some people would like, um, but there does come a point where it does get a bit too long. So, I'm going to love you and leave you. And uh, I hope you guys have a lovely day. Thank you for watching. I love you. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.